someone else maintains that great dish wide by the outlet, you've got more time to focus on something else. You. Boom! Say hello to one of our 100 percent US based customer service call centers. If you need help or want to make an easy switch, you can call and talk to a real person in Arizona like the name here. Yep, and definitely a real person. Prove it. It's really not a robot. Okay, so it's clear. Consumer Sterling offers amazing 5G coverage. Backed up by a service. That wouldn't mean much. That's super good prices. You've already known what I'm passing. Well, guess what? Guess what? You're out of here. I was trying to get the channel that gives me Star Trek. Uh, I have not succeeded, but I think I am a lot closer. But wait. There is more. I fixed the key to my car and it does turn it now. I don't know what the fuck I even did other than put a main fucking intention onto whatever the hell I did. I put all the guts back in the, uh, the key fob thing stuff, but that key never really worked. It was the secondary key. It didn't even open the doors the first time I try to use it, so, um, I'm surprised that it, I've been able to, but it does, but after the last time when I got it to work unexpectedly, I ended up with my windows rolled down, and guess what, it quit working, they had been all fucking down, everything open, the, not the way you want to do it. And at the time, there was no thing that I knew to do that I could do. There wasn't. And I waited a while. And I had a feeling that if I went at it again the next time, I would get it. And I was right. I've got all my windows rolled up. Uh, my battery did die because... Somebody keeps going in there fucking turning on the lights. And this time when they did it, it ran the battery dead. But there is weird shit that people do. I don't know why. I don't think I'll ever have those answers. But they do it. We have a lot of gang stalking in this um, area that I live. And it could be anybody because those people that do that have a form of awareness that isn't actually noticing when they do it. saying someone's trying to take a loan out. There's always some sort of crazy fucking fraudulent activity going on with the fucking phones. And honestly, they better not give somebody a fucking $4,300 loan. But I really don't know what does it, how it's happening when it happens. I circumvent it and tell them, no. No, I do not want to verify that this is something I'm doing, because it's not. What the fuck are you doing? Is more like how what I feel like saying. 
and I bet it is probably the person that's um, responding is probably the guy that's doing it. That's usually the case a lot more times than you you would think. Oh, he's just a innocent business. No, wrong, wrong. No innocent business guy. He's a fucking weirdo. Fucking, I'm trying to get a loan out of your fucking name and shit, guy, which is pretty sleazy. All right, I don't fucking want your loan. I didn't ask for it, and I'm not going to allow it. There's so many weird things that are people that are doing at this time because uh, need money is bad. Need money bad. Need money bad. You hear? Those are the springs in my bed. Hopefully they don't, like, pop out of there and murder me one day. I thought, man, that sounds pretty violent. I wonder why they do that. You put any weight on it, they get stuck. And then they unstick their self. And if you're on the bed, it makes a very strange feeling sensation. I don't think any of the other spring beds I've ever had had acted like that. Perhaps that's why they uh, left it at the dump for trash. I don't know. I was actually needing another bed, and to me, it was treasure. And I wouldn't take a bed if it weren't fully in the plastic, which it was, because that's like nasty. I don't want to sleep on anybody's fucking bullshit. Wet dreams, sexy times, uh, funky fluids, different ills. I don't want nothing to do with it. If that's what you like, more power to you. As for me, nope. I don't think so. I don't want that. I'm trying to think of everything that has occurred. I'm trying to do the yard a little bit, but it had just rained, so it's kind of wet. But there was just some areas where we have to walk I wanted to get into, despite it not technically being the appropriate time yet. Since I'm mowing like a crackhead that doesn't wait on the drying out part. And that's not good for your lawnmower. And I told him, I said, this isn't going to be good for you. But God damn it, we got to get it done. Lawnmower said, all right. Shit, you put it like that, I'm fine. And that's the way it is. Today is strange. I'm downloading another screen recorder because of the performance issues I'm having with the one I use. Although it is the same as my um, uh, photoshopping app. It's not that good. It crashes every single time I use it. And it never alerts me to that fact. I think I'm fucking recording and everything is fine. And it's not fine. It's terminated uh, its point of recording. And didn't even get the whole full video. So it arbitrarily stopped somewhere under reasons I don't quite get, and I, I don't like it. I'm not going to like it, so I'm not. Therefore, a 
obliged to use it any further. Not doing it. I got to do me.